The intake valve only has to be kept open while the piston is in the intake stroke. And the exhaust valve has to be kept closed while the piston is in the exhaust stroke. However, valve timing must take into account the fact that the inertias of both intake and exhaust increase as the engine speed increases. Specifically, the intake valve starts to open before the piston begins its intake stroke and closes after the stroke. Similarly, the exhaust valve starts to open before the piston begins its exhaust stroke and closes after the stroke. Such valve operation timing ensures efficient intake and exhaust. A chart showing valve operation timing in terms of crankshaft angle is called a valve timing diagram. As this diagram shows, each valve is opened or closed earlier with respect to the piston position in each stroke, thereby improving the intake and exhaust efficiencies, as well as enabling each valve to be fully open at the optimum time. There is a period of time during which both intake and exhaust valves are open. This period is called valve overlap. To enable each valve to open or close smoothly, appropriate clearance must be provided around the valve. This is called valve clearance.